Live from WPRI 12, this is The Road Show. And good morning, everybody, and welcome to The Road Show. Happy Wednesday. Thanks for joining us today. You are taking a, uh, a long, live look <laughs> as we walk along Blackstone Boulevard on this Wednesday morning. Great place to be. People out uh, running, walking, sitting there. You can have, you know, something to eat in the morning. People sitting there having lunch in the afternoon. Blackstone Boulevard is uh, is a beautiful place. That used to be one of my favorite spots it in is. college to go running, to go walking with friends. Absolutely. Beautiful. Absolutely. Beautiful. When I was a little kid, uh, I know, you know, in the stroller, my mother would take me to Blackstone Boulevard all the time. Yeah. And, you know, be pushing me down Blackstone Boulevard. It is. It's a great path. Yes. So many people always right. over there. Right. Beautiful yeah. scenery around yeah. you. I love it. And a lot of people, because they put in the uh, the bike lanes are over there now, too. So oh, they have bike lanes Yeah, there's now. bike lanes, too. So a lot of folks are out there oh, riding, that's great. riding their bikes as well. So if you're uh, looking for some place to go, maybe. You take a stroll on a day like today because it is going to be beautiful. It's going to be hot. It's going to be, gonna be a be hot beautiful. one. That's I, a uh, that's a place to. I be. love a good hot day. I like do this, too. Though. I Look, have I'm to be happy. honest. If it's I'm summer, happy. might as well be hot. Might right? as well be warm. Let's oh, go. I wonder how warm it was yesterday because the Jeffrey Osborne Celebrity Classic, the golf tournament, was back in Rhode Island after a three-year hiatus. It was held at the Kirkbride Country Club right there in Lincoln yesterday. Beautiful day for it. Great day for it. Now all of the uh, the money raised will go to local charities and organizations. Musician and host, and he is a great guy. Jeffrey Osborne mm -hmm. spoke about the importance of helping out in his home state. The most beautiful thing is to be able to come back to where I was born and raised and help give back to the community. So that's important. That's something my mother always instilled in me. She said, well, if you do well, make sure you give back. That's right. That's great. WPRI 12 and Fox Providence are proud sponsors of the Jeffrey Osborne Celebrity Classic Golf Tournament. So that is a that's a good thing. And you know what? I, I know this is going to be like one of these geeky things, but what? you know, I've loved music all, all of my life. Yeah. You know, all, since I was a kid and, you know, been around music and everything else. And it, if you had told me that I'd be somewhat friends with like you know because Jeffrey Osborne was huge oh, he, you know it was big he right. turn the radio on he knows you he ran right over yeah, it, was, it was just so you know it was so funny between between him and then obviously you know Smokey, Smokey. Robinson was there and you know we would just I know, the, the best was literally I know we mentioned yesterday but he was waiting in line at the bar just to get like a drink or something right you walk right over <laughs> You know, start chit-chatting with them, you know, chit-chats just, back with you, yes. and I'm thinking, I mean, if you stop and think about it, how amazing is that? Right, right. Right? Yeah. You and Smokey. Yeah, yeah, it's just it's just so funny. It really, it really still cracks me up at 53 years old. All right, Brendan, it, it is funny, though, right? It you is. See these? And uh, Jeffrey Osborne is terrific, he and is. it's just great, and he's so right about giving back. That's what yeah. it's all about. That's he it. is on the wings of awesome. He is he on the really wings is. of awesome. You know, speaking of Blackstone Boulevard, here's a BK fun fact. I, I was once dumped by a girl on Blackstone Boulevard. Oh, How wow. about that, huh? Were you really? Is <laughs> that true? We laugh Can you about still it now. It? I, I don't care at all now, but it was hilarious. Do you want a name? <laughs> Her initials are Audrey McClellan. <laughs> well, I no, 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 no. Yeah. The joke. But uh, good morning, friends. Good morning, good morning. Just, You gotta laugh at life, right? Mm -hmm. Well, today uh, is July 12th. But guys, as evidenced by this, it's also National Paper Bag Day. Oh. Now they can be quite functional, as as we all know. Mm -hmm. I've got one here, as you can see, and you've got yours right there, right? Yeah. Okay. Now I had this idea yesterday, so I needed paper bags, and I said to you, I said, Audrey, you're a mom. You <laughs> yes. must have some paper bags around the house. So you checked, and you texted me later in the day, and this I is did. what you sent me right here. Okay, so oh, these are good ones. Yeah, I did. I these are good ones, sure. But then, because you are very conscientious, you followed it up with this. And you said with the caption for reference, tell me what's going on. I said, I just wanted him to know how big they are. Got it. Because, you know, when you see a brown bag like this, you might think, oh, big bigger. bag. So I said to Victoria, hold it up to your head so Brendan can get a gauge. It's like a as scale. To how big it scale is. how big she the said, bag is. She said, do I cover my face? I said, you can if you want to. Sure, sure. Great, I love it. So now we know. So, much. so that, that's how we put these, you know, soon to be Emmy Award winning pieces together, right? So uh, for you guys, those small bags will work, but I need a bigger one because I carry a lot of things. Mm -hmm. Right, so I'll take it from here, okay? So people wonder, what does BK carry around all day? Well, of course, I have my hair gel right there. I can't leave, uh, you know, leave home without that. Uh, I carry around pictures of Will Gilbert, and oh. you know, because I people, I don't have my own headshots, so I just sign these when people ask. <laughs> there <you> go. Nice. <laughs> I got a box of them on Look, my desk fantastic if you want. Fantastic right there. Um, what else do we have in here? One of my always trusted combs. And get yourself a comb, a comb, a comb with a handle. This is like the Cadillac. Yeah 
lack of combs. Oh, it's it's uh, follically flawless. And what else do we have in here? Oh, my Tic Tacs, my trusted Tic Tacs, because if having fresh breath is wrong, I don't want to be right. Oh, of course, you know me. I'm always making notes over here. Boy, there's so much in here. Pencils, right? You got to have those. You can never have too too many pencils, really. I think, you know... <laughs> This is my favorite one, as you all know. You can never have enough of those. In case the roadshow set gets a little dirty, I have a Swiffer in here as well. That helps us out. And you know, in case it starts raining on one of these hot days, an umbrella. So there you go. Wow, great job. Very nice. Great job. Very nice. Unfortunately, this bag is still not big enough for my ego. Thank you very much. Wasn't it worth the effort? Okay. A lot of baggage. Came, yes, I do. I came in extra early to put that all together because I care about you. All right, Wednesday morning is here, and it's going to be another hot one. It's actually going to be so hot today that I will be grateful for the chilly reception that that comedy bit will get later online. Thank you. Let's send it to the kitchen. Nick Raybar awaits. Look, Nick Raybar was thrilled with that. He said it was good stuff. That Jeff. was good stuff. Nick Raybar's here. 